you're looking to get into the nursing field, uh, you'll want to go to a nursing program and you're going to need to prepare for that. A nurse is about 90% calling and 10% job. Every day we come face to face with life, death, joy, and grief. And over the course of our nursing lives, we never quit learning. Some things we learn only nurses would understand, and some are universal. I will dispense with a little of what we've learned now. I'm a nurse. And this is how to prepare for nursing school. First things first, you'll obviously need a high school diploma or a GED. And then you'll need to find a local college that is a nursing program that's right for you, depending on if you'd rather be an RN, a registered nurse, an LPN, a licensed practical nurse, or a nurse practitioner, which you'd pretty much go to the same as a registered nurse and then specialize thereafter. Uh, first things first, you want to make sure your grades you come out of high school with are very good because it'll be a lot easier to get into a program if you've got good grades. Uh, another thing you'll want to do is just make sure that you find a nursing program that's close to you. You don't want to do a lot of traveling when you're going through nursing career because sometimes it becomes a little stressful and it's hard to do a lot of work when you have a lot of travel time involved as well. Uh, you'll go through at least four pairs of shoes a year. A comfortable pair is your most important piece of equipment. That and coffee. And wash your hands. I know that sounds obvious, but it bears repeating. Saying you're a nurse and being a nurse are two very different things. Your very first medication will be a dose of reality. Your second will be a dose of humility. You will learn to deal with life and death every day but you'll be helping families who are dealing with it for the first time. Um, make sure to go to and talk to the nursing instructors at the school of your choice, and they can help prepare you for everything you'll need throughout the course, vaccinations, first aid and CPR certificates. Usually what you'll need to do also is become a certified nursing assistant first. In certain states, they make you do that. There are a lot of different options, but if you look at your community college of your choice and talk to a nursing instructor, they can walk you through any steps you have any questions about. Patients will teach you more than you teach them. Check, recheck, then recheck again. You'll learn to love sticking people and take pride in being able to establish an IV where others didn't think it possible. There will be a patient now and again who will remind you of why you chose to be a nurse. Embrace those moments. Remember to breathe. In the end, everything you do comes to naught if you don't do one thing. When it's all said and done, you simply have to care.